New EAS, spot on me from Zay College in Mount Holly, Palmer and Holly. Uh, also here in the weather center. So I want to mention one thing, too. That thing's had a tornado warning on it for the last two hours. Well, we had three tornadoes in my state from the squall line yesterday. Strongest one was in uh, Aiken County. Low end EF2 with 115 mile an hour winds. We had a high end EF1 in Calhoun County. With a severe thunderstorm warning was issued. We had another EF2 in Richmond County, Georgia. And made that forward. They confirmed one in Itchfield County. And one in uh, Arlington County. There we go. If you've been with us now for the duration, you're watching the storm crossing now in Lebanon. I want to show you all some before I end this video. You have to remember there's still weather back behind this. There are still thunderstorms that could move through the region here within the next hour or so. And that's what this yellow zone is. Now that is all a severe thunderstorm warning. Here is the velocity, so whether or not we're seeing any more rotation back there. See, confirmed EF2 tornado in Aiken County, confirmed EF1 in Calhoun County, and a confirmed EF2 in Burke and Richmond County. There was an EF0 in Edgefield County, an EF1 in Lexington County. Think along Lake Murray out there. And I think you said it best earlier. We may end up tomorrow morning looking at the situation and find that there was no actually reported confirmed tornadoes. That's not out of the question of that happening here in our neck of the woods, that we warn storms more for the precaution uh, of keeping people safe than seeing those typical storms That's out the in the Midwest. This isn't the same zone. We don't see those storms that long track for 30 miles across the region. It may actually end up that this skipped along the way and maybe there'll be pockets of some damage here and then others don't see anything at all. Or, as we may hope, we don't see any damage at all. But at this point, this is the time to take it uh, and get to safety. When you see circulations like this, too, it's not necessarily mean. It's an indicator, but not necessarily mean. All right, so we've got, let's see what time it is. We're almost to 9 o'clock. So it's just... Of the inequality. So we're going to come up on another situation where the National Weather Service has to make a determination. Do they want to extend it? Do they want to change the path of this as well as far as where the box is? You see the red box underneath, that is the area that is officially under the tornado warning. You get into parts of Schuylkill County and, and uh, Berks County as well. So now we're going to be getting close to where 81 takes more of that northerly track getting up towards Wolfsburg Strand. So for anyone that really is just north of uh, Jonestown, 